want to ask you something. Do you know what a heart is? Or do you know why heart spreads so quickly? Ladies and gentlemen, Victoria Glory Mamanke is my name and I'm a student at SMK Kriyan Susi Doarjo. Today, let me take this opportunity to discuss the value of literacy and the part that people can play in resolving this literacy crisis. I want to start by asking a question. Do you understand what literacy is? Literacy is a person's ability to process and understand information when carrying out the process of reading and writing. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'll discuss the effects of low literacy. You can see the effects of low literacy in the number of songs that circulate on social media and generate rift between opposing parties. These songs can also lead to criminal activity since they disseminate misinformation within the population. The first fact is that a lot of literacy causes many young people to become lazy, lack knowledge, and they are unable to compete other regions and even outside countries. It is difficult to get a job because of lack of knowledge. Young people who are lazy to read will find it difficult to socialize because of lack of insight. And young people will find it difficult to develop their potential because of lack of knowledge. The second truth is that Indonesia ranks 62nd out of 70 countries in terms of literacy levels, placing it in the bottom 10 countries with low literacy levels. This is based on a survey done by the Organization for Economic Cooperation and published in 2019. The third statistic is that 60 million Indonesians own a gadget, ranking the country fifth in the globe. According to the Digital Marketing Research Family Marketer, the number of active smartphone users in Indonesia will exceed 100 million by 2018. With such a big number, Indonesia will become the world's fourth largest active smartphone user after China, India, and the United States. Ironically, data from WearSocial as of January 2017 showed that Indonesia may start at gadget screens for most than half the day despite having little interest in reading books. Ladies and gentlemen, as a result, you play a crucial role in raising national literacy levels. The community that owns gadgets or technology is made up of young people. By joining reading groups, promoting reading, creating an environment that is suitable to learning, and using technology only for good, like for education, we young people may boost national literacy. The knowledge we get from engaging in all these activities can be put to use to raise the nation's literacy rate. The study's funding support the notion that literacy is crucial for both enhancing our skills and the nation's people resources. With the help of the solutions I previously described, we young people, the new generation, may increase literacy. Why dogs spread so quickly is the topic I asked her earlier, and looks like you all already know the answer. Hogs proliferate quickly due to Indonesia low interest in literacy, and slow reading can make it difficult for you to discern some intentions. For instance, Suppose your friend says it must boy in the next class because there's a hobby, both in classical music. But you interpret her statement incorrectly, without knowing whether it is true or not, you believe what you understand it to mean, that your friend likes someone. Your way of thinking makes it possible to construct hoax, and if you distribute them and other people fall for them, the hoax can spread swiftly. I hope that my speak will increase your literacy knowledge and encourage you to help to help enhance national literacy and minimize the spread of hoax that can split our country. Let us young people contribute to national literacy. Thank you for your time and consideration. I sincerely apologize for any improper comments or behavior. Best wishes and farewell.